Actually, that was where I was supposed to go, ironically. I know Wolf's in trouble, but you got time for this, right? Yeah, I got it, baby. This is, uh, this is old good panic knife. Panic, good knife. Good knife panic. Dive! No worries. I'll get back up there and go take my bla my uh my blast core, my prize in this game, and continue onward. Pick up package. Look at that. Boom. Hopefully, I get a nice power out of this one. Whoa. Wolf, pretty sure I found it. Still at the lab? McGrath. Oh. The shards there. Oh, God. Good Lord, man. Oh, crap. Look at that. Wolf! I really do think the graphics in this game are better than the first one, which is impressive because this isn't exactly a new system. I'm on my way. As I said before, I, I like the comic book stylings of the game. I'm a big fan of, uh,. You know, nerdy things, I guess, but it's the art style is just kind of cool. Uh, that's not good. There we go. At least let me let me pick up on there. The funny thing about the first game was that you would miss those jumps and then like just like that. Okay, never mind. I was gonna say you'd miss those jumps and just ruin yourself. That you'd have to get somewhere in a time period and you just would not be able to do it because you stink at video games, kind of like me, and you miss a jump. And this one it looks like it's a, it gives you a little bit of oh shoot gives you a little bit of leeway and lets you miss the jump by at least like an inch or two and not kill yourself too easily. But as you can see, I'm having trouble getting up this building. I'm sure Sucker Punch is gonna love the fact that I'm tweeting them with this video. Of, oh, ouch! Where I just completely make a mockery of their game uh, in terms of how horribly I play it. Uh, I need to some life here from something. Uh, where am I going to get it from? Uh oh. Take it from the car. That's the nice part about the uh, this game is that you can really heal yourself with almost anything. Cars and light poles and all kinds of random scenery. It's also pretty destructible. I mean, it's not entirely destructible like a like, like a battlefield or something like that where you can just blow up any building, but you can definitely... Screw you, buddy. Ah! Boom, boom, boom. Get out of my sight! I think I'm going the wrong way, but we'll see. So, in this walkthrough, um, I'm planning on more or less uh, playing through whichever missions strike my fancy, the sort of stuff that I would have done anyway, um, regardless of whether I was doing it for the Awful Gamer or not. You know, I'm not the kind of guy who typically does all of the side quests, though if there's a demand for that, you know, like a walkthrough once I'm done with it the first time, I'd be happy to help out, um, mostly just because I want to horror for this, yeah. these, uh, you know, the hits oh. and everything, but... Dr. Wolf. <laughs> My God, you're just the same. Same as who? Kessler, the man who gave you your powers. I know. <laughs> uh, that's Kessler. because I am him. <laughs> oh, spoiler alert. Sorry, buddies. He told me all about his plans for you. And the beast. Well, then you know I failed. I couldn't stop it. Empire City is gone. Yes, and, and it won't stop it. Unless you expand your abilities. Become powerful enough to use this. Another ray sphere. No. Ray field inhibitor. I call it the RFI. Think of it as an anti ray sphere. So instead of giving powers, it takes them away. Precisely. With that device, you can combat the beast, subtract his abilities, keep it safe. Yeah. What about. About this. Isn't that gonna oh, make lost scores? They power the RFI. The batteries for the same energy that fuels all genetic mutation. Pass a current. Is it gonna make coal not be able to use its powers? Energy will release into the nearest conduit. Because I don't like that. 
Oh, Lord, yes, and that's just the first. <laughs> Together we will defeat the beast. Oh, enough of the pep talk, Wolf. Let's do this. Ha 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 ha! It's like electric crack. Wonder what I get out of this one. Absorb the energy of six more blast cores to use the RFI. So I guess that's my first real task in this game. And uh, I think it's going to be... The, the format of the game is going to be a little bit of a countdown, it, it seems. That's kind of cool. Okay, I don't know why he's shooting. I don't know how he got on the roof. came back. starting to haul you guys away. Quo's still off chasing the fellows with Wolf. So, uh... What happened? That old guy slipped you a roofie? No. <laughs> no, I actually think I might have a new power. Really? Come on, let's see what you got. Stretch your stuff, Okay. Peacock. Lift an object. Throw it. Okay. Alright, what am I going to lift and throw? How about I lift this dude up? Oh! Oh, snap! Now that's pretty cool. Throw a car and defeat one of the militia with a thrown object. Okay. Can do. Where are you at, baby? Guess I'm gonna go to have to go on the uh, car level, or off the car level, the street level to do the, some of these things. All right, now I'm gonna kill this mother. Dang it. There it is. There it is. Right there. Yeah, that works. Boom, baby! Okay, I'm way too excited about that. Anyway, so this is a good point to stop. It looks like. Um, yet again, we're we stopped at a at the end of a mission. I think that's what I'm going to try to do, considering I want to keep these videos at least moderately short. I really, <laughs> I'm really having fun with this game. Uh, I hope you guys would have too if you pick it up. Um, this is probably one of the more fun uh, first uh, single-player games so far I've had out there. I'm really looking forward to see where, seeing where it goes. This is Panic Knife with theawfulgamer.com, and have a great day.